Okay, the reason why I'm doing this is because I was having problem with my monitor that is connected to my computer. Uh, it was working fine and then suddenly it stopped working. So what I want to do is uninstall the software to help to connect my monitor with the computer and give it a try again. This method also works to remove programs and application as well. well the first thing we got to do is to click on Finder and we're going to click on Applications and we're going to find the specific program or software or application that you download. In this case, it's going to be Display Link Manager. So we're going to click on the loop and we're going to type this Display Link or whatever software you want to remove. And then it's going to give you a couple options. And okay, so I have these two options, but this is not all. So we have to go deeper in here. So for that, we're going to click on the plus on the right side and we're going to click where it says name. We're going to scroll down and click other and we're going to search for system files. Let's make sure to check mark the box next to it and click OK. And then we click on the next menu, arrow down, and then we're going to select R included. By doing this, it's going to show us more files and folder that supposedly belong to the same program. But before we delete anything, we have to double check, open every single one and make sure it actually belongs to the same program. And once we are sure, all we do now is highlight them all and throw them into the trash can. You gotta type in your password in order to delete them and then hit OK. In order to permanently delete the files, we gotta go into the finder, look for anti trash can, and then hit anti trash can again. Basically, what we just did, we can also do this to any program in the application folder and even firmware. After permanently delete all these files, I download the software again, I reinstall the software and my monitor start working again. So this is a method that you can do when something goes wrong. All right, guys, that's it for me. Thanks for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you. Don't forget to subscribe, like my video, leave a comment if you have any questions, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.